So I wanted to do a video today about um, ancestry and ancestry websites to be more exact. Um, I see a lot of people online, a lot of friends and family and stuff like that. They're, I don't know, they seem to be a little confused about these ancestry sites and what they find and what they're looking for. And I'm gonna try to lend my insight a little bit and I don't know, give a little bit more clarity. Um, I'm trying not to make this video too long. Um, so some big ones you have, um, you have AfricanAncestry.com and then you have like 23andMe and these different ones. Um, I think pretty much all of them, I think, except for AfricanAncestry.com, they do sell their, the genetic information that they get to pharmaceutical companies and what have you. I think AfricanAncestry.com is the only one that does not currently sell it. And that's not to say that they're not gonna sell it in the future. Um, but I think all of the companies are very misleading on the process, um, how much of your DNA that they can even actually map. It's a very small percentage. Um, you can actually look up, if you go on YouTube or Google, you can Google like interviews that have been done by the founders of these companies where they're kind of admitting that they're only, they can only really track and trace like less than 0.1% of your DNA. That's not an exaggeration. Um, African ancestry in particular, what they do is they trace they don't tell you the percentages of you of what you are as an individual. So I see a lot of people, they get results back from African ancestry and they're like disappointed because they thought they were this or thought they were that. Well, African ancestry is not telling you what you are right now. They're not telling you what your genetic makeup is right now. They're tracing your paternal and or maternal lines about six generations back to see what paternal line you came from about six generations ago. So for example, and again, they're only mapping and tracing less than 0.1% of your DNA to get, the, to get these results for you. Um, and it's misleading, I know, but they're, they're selling a product. And um, so what they're doing is they're trying to trace your maternal line. So you could come from six generations ago, you can come from a maternal line, especially with African-Americans. You can, your maternal line or paternal line can come from paternal being father, maternal being mother, can come from a white person just because of the way this country developed. But generations removed, as you are as an individual, you are African American. You could be, you know, 90% of your DNA could be African American, African DNA. Um, but they're not gonna tell you that. They can only tell you based on less than 0.1% of your DNA, what maternal or paternal line you came from. Um, and that is what they do in a nutshell. I'm trying to keep this in layman's terms. So if you go do an African ancestry and you're black, you know you're black, or you're whatever you, you think you are, you're white, whatever, and they do your paternal, they do give you your results on ancestry, just know they're only tracing your maternal and paternal line back. I've seen some YouTube videos where they're like, people are disappointed because they're like, oh my God, my whole life is a lie. But they're not telling you what you are. Now the other sites like 23andMe and these Ancestry.coms and things like that, they are kind of telling you the percentages of what you are as an individual. Um, and again, they're only able to really only track a small amount of your DNA. And I don't know what these percentages are with them in particular, but again, if you wanna get more accurate numbers as to what your percentages of DNA-wise of your individual self, you can go with companies like that. I don't recommend giving your DNA to any of these companies, um, not even the black-owned ones even though African Ancestry doesn't 
sell your DNA to pharmaceutical companies right now doesn't mean they won't start in the future. So you want to keep that in mind. And again, they can only tell you based on your maternal line what you're linked to based off of a minute number of your DNA. Um, so that's my little spiel on that. I didn't mean to make this video that long. I just kind of wanted to touch on that. Um, again, I'm new to this YouTube thing. Um, I'm going to try to drop more videos. Um, I have some fitness videos and health videos and stuff like that, travel videos coming up soon. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Drop a comment.